Hello everyone and welcome to the 11 best dog breeds. Number 11. Portuguese Water Dog. Portuguese water dogs were first bred to herd fish, find misplaced gear or shattered nets, and transport packages from ship to shore. As they are loving, independent, smart, and simple to train, they are good for people with allergies and make wonderful companions. Portuguese water dogs are sociable with outsiders and like to be petted. Just be aware that boredom can lead to destructive behavior in them, just like it does in many larger dogs. Number 10. Newfoundland Dog. The most adorable dogs are Newfoundlands, also referred to as nature's babysitter. The fictional Nana from Peter Pan, who was so wonderful with kids, is possibly the most well-known Newfoundland. These gentle giants are renowned for their placid dispositions and are incredibly obedient and simple to train. Additionally adept swimmers, Newfoundlands were bred to save people from drowning, one famously saved Napoleon Bonaparte. Number 9. Maltese. Maltese dogs, one of the oldest toy breeds, were bred to be affectionate and sweet toward their owners. The Greeks even built tombs for their Maltese dogs, who were known as the Comforter during the Elizabethan era because it was thought they could heal ailments and ease pain. Maltese dogs have silky coats that don't shed, making them incredibly hypoallergenic. These dogs are also suitable for apartment living due to their size. Number 8. Golden Retrievers. The perfect companion dog, Goldens are sweet and devoted. Instead of playing outside without you, they would prefer to be sleeping at your feet. Additionally, they have a very even temper, especially around young children. Due to their amiable and tolerant personalities, Golden Retrievers make excellent service and comfort dogs. In addition, they were developed as retrieving dogs for hunters, so if you enjoy playing fetch, this is the dog for you. Number 7. Huskies. With their thick fur coat and striking eyes, Siberian Huskies are magnificent creatures. Most people who choose Huskies do so because they are incredibly beautiful. Huskies are friendly dogs that show children affection. They don't have the typical dog odor that larger breeds frequently have, and they only shed a small amount twice a year when they blow out their coat. Since they require a lot of attention, exercise, and are adept at escaping and running away, Huskies are not generally recommended as a breed for novice dog owners. Number 6. Poodles. Poodles are misunderstood. However, because they are so intelligent, lively, fun-loving, and devoted family dogs, they are also simple to train. Poodles are people-oriented dogs, so don't be surprised if you find that they are always around you. Poodles can be attention seekers. They can become aggressive with people from outside the family or with other dogs. They are also fiercely protective of their homes and families. Number 5. Beagles. Beagles are trained by law enforcement to sniff out prohibited items in luggage because of their intelligence. Beagles don't frighten travelers because of their friendly nature and appealing appearance. This breed is suitable for families with young children because it lacks inherited health issues and has a level temperament. Because their owners couldn't stand their howling, beagles are free frequently abandoned or given to the pound. By early dog training to prevent excessive barking, this can be managed. Number 4. German Shepherds. German Shepherds are an exceptional breed of dog, dating back to 1899, and are brave, obedient, incredibly loyal, and eager to learn. Additionally intelligent, German Shepherds are excellent at almost anything they are taught. They are typically employed as police and service dogs to guard officers and search for drugs or human remains. German Shepherds are so devoted to their owners that they experience separation anxiety and may act out when left alone at home and bored. Number 3. Pembroke Welsh Corgis. Corgis are known for being playful and affectionate, which contributes to their cult-like following. The Pembroke Welsh Corgi was even the preferred mode of transportation for fairies, according to Welsh mythology. Corgis are good with kids and have a strong desire to please their owners, despite the fact that they can be shy around strangers. With their large ears, long torso, and big butt, they also have one of the silliest appearances of any dog. Simply keep a close eye on their food intake because this breed is prone to overeating. Number 2. Labrador Retrievers. There is a good reason why Labradors are the most popular breed in the United States, Australia, Canada, New Zealand, and the United Kingdom. They have even temperaments, 
are devoted and obedient, and get along well with both kids and other animals. Labs are intelligent and frequently chosen as guide dogs and service dogs for blind or autistic people. They were bred to be eager to please and playful companions. They can be trained to assist law enforcement and other government agencies by screening and detection work, and they also make compassionate therapy dogs. Number 1. Mixed Breeds Mutts are awesome no matter what breeds are mixed together. Dr. Sarah Ward Fatula, a veterinarian, thinks mixed breed animals are less likely than purebred animals to have genetic inherited health issues. Additionally, if you adopt your mixed breed animal from a shelter, not only will it already have been spayed or neutered, microchipped, and immunized to date, but you'll also be contributing to the solution to the pet overpopulation issue. That's all 11 best dog breeds. Which one is your favorite to own? Let me know in the comments below and don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the bell for notifications. See you next time.